Uh, my name is Shanna Meyer. I'm the president of Enchanted Playhouse Theater Company. Uh, my name is Robert Meyer. I'm treasurer of Enchanted Playhouse Theater Company. And welcome to First Friday. Enchanted Playhouse Theater Company is a family-friendly theater company. We do school shows, school field trips. Uh, we've had up to, for one show and four shows, uh, 5,000 kids come through. And for our, our, our school shows and our public shows, our biggest thing is to make sure it's always affordable to everybody. That's why our prices not really changed much in, in the 30 years of our history. For the community, it gives kids an opportunity to come in to, and see our shows, especially our school shows, and know that it's okay to make believe. It can also teach them problem solving, and it's yeah, good for those that are in the show and good for those that come to watch it. There, there, there was one production that, that there was uh, someone that came to us that they were uh, really depressed in their life and they got talked into to come here with, by one of their friends and audition and actually excelled at it and they, their, their total outlook on life changed completely and we hear these stories after the fact, like maybe years after the fact without even knowing what's going on. We're, we're affecting people's lives without even knowing we're affecting their lives, but we find out down the road. We got involved because of my daughter, Jamie Meyer. Um, about seven, eight years ago, she was involved in a production. She was in Elves and the Shoemaker. And then she asked me to start auditioning with her. And I started doing a couple shows with her. And then she wrote my husband in. Yeah, uh, Shannon had been doing a bunch of shows and she was kind of wanted to take a little bit of a break, but Jamie didn't want to take a break. So she uh, asked me to do it. I acted in high school a little bit, so it had been years since I've done it, but I was like, ah, whatever, I'll do it. Well. Once I got on, I got hooked and started getting involved big time with the organization. Well, the biggest challenge, of course, was moving out of the Main Street Theater and then having to find a way to redo everything all over again because we've had a theater company um, and um, I mean, we've had a theater be in this whole entire time. And then when it was time for us to move out, that's when Shan and I kind of took over leadership in the organization. and. I'll be honest with you, Shannon and I have no idea what we were doing when we took <laughs> over. We, it was like, okay, <laughs> it seems like it's the right thing to do. Basically kind of ran the organization for the next couple of years. And then when COVID hit, it of course hit us really hard because we couldn't do theater anymore. Um, so we basically, first I came up with the ideas of virtual theater. I sent all of our virtual theater we did out to the schools and they were very grateful for it to have something that they can have their kids watch that still gave them that little bit of theater aspect of it. When we were able to do outdoor performances, first we did an outdoor performance here at Grace Lutheran uh, Grace Christian School with Reluctant Dragon, but we couldn't invite schools. Once things opened up a little bit more to do outdoor theater, uh, we brokered a deal with Rawhide and were able to get schools to come see a show safely outdoors. A lot of these kids haven't even been to a Rawhide Stadium, to a baseball stadium. So that was something that was really rewarding. And even some, some people on the Rawhide staff, when they saw these kids coming, everything, they kind of saw the difference that it can make to these kids. We are rehearsing right now, currently for Snow White. Uh, we are both directing that along with uh, Sherryana Urban and then our daughter, Jamie Meyer, um, as student director. Uh, the scenes that we were rehearsing were uh, part of the queen uh, doing the spell, creating the poison apple that she's yes. giving to Snow White. Um, mm -hmm. <sighs> Where is he? Where is that huntsman? Oh, Mirror, I can hardly wait. I can hardly wait until I have her heart right here in my hands. <sighs> Your Majesty, I've returned. There you are. Where have you been? Well, I've been obeying your command, Your Majesty. Well, it certainly took you long enough. All you had to do was kill her. Yes, Your Majesty. Well, let me see it! Here it is, Your Majesty. Yes, thank you. Ha ha ha! At last, proof that little Miss Snow White is dead! <sighs> now I'm the fairest. <laughs> To tell you the truth, Huntsman, Little Miss Goody Goody was my only real competition. Uh, yes, Your Majesty. Oh? You agree? She is more beautiful than I am? Leave. Oh, beautiful queen. Mirror! Oh, Mirror, wake up! Rather busy. Oh, tell me. Guess what? What? 
Little Miss Snow White is dead. <laughs> no. I have her heart right here. Oh, <laughs> oh my, you really surprised yourself. This time, mm. oh. And then there's also email at info at enchantedplayhouse.org. You could go to our website and all that information is on there, www.enchantedplayhouse.org. Um, or we also have a Facebook, we have an Instagram that you can subscribe to as well and get all the information on there. You come out and audition. We always have our auditions up on our Facebook, our website. We are hoping to have and start back up again our workshops, summer workshops for children where they could come and learn all the different aspects of theater and acting and get to actually perform a play for their parents and friends and loved ones that can come and see it. Um, and then there's also, of course, financial support <laughs> that we can always need, um, sponsors, um, ads in our program uh, that helps pay for getting these big ticket, big quality shows to these kids without having to raise our prices. In other ways, people can get involved. As well. I mean, we need set builders, we need uh, costumers. We, we have all these people, but 
They've been doing every single show all the time. So I mean, if you've got an interest, we'll find someone to teach you. Make a set building, uh, costumes. Uh, we have our director, Shariana, with us. Uh, she's an amazing painter. And she's gonna be painting our sets. She's painting some raffle items for us. It's an art that really, you can develop any side of your character and any side of what you really enjoy and bringing that to and contributing to the whole project. Um, I had no idea that I enjoyed building sets or building stuff. Uh, the table that's out there uh, for the Seven Dwarfs, I built that myself from scratch. It's the first time I ever built a table in my entire life. Uh, I, it's some of the most fun I've ever had in my entire life. We'd like to thank our show sponsors, uh, the Sun Gazette, um, Well Care by HealthNet, the uh, Honey Pearl Cafe, uh, Paradise Pool, uh, Bravante Produce, that's it, right? <laughs> and uh, Roberson uh, McLaughlin uh, Plumbing, Inc. And we would love to thank uh, Grace Christian School, Grace Lutheran Church. Every show for the past four shows, they've generously donated rehearsal space for us. Um, the only thing they get in exchange is an ad in our program, and the kids at the school get to come to see our show for free. Um, they never charge us for rehearsal space, and they give us a lot of space, and have even sometimes moved meetings around um, to give us that rehearsal space. So that's huge for us. If we want to keep this affordable for everyone, it's important that we have donors that donate to us and help uh, uh, help our organization. If you're interested, we'll set up a time for you guys to come and see an actual performance in April. We'll come see the kids out there. Come see the, the kids yelling and screaming and getting into the show because you really can't understand what we do unless you actually are there to see the kids because uh, it amps up the room. I mean, some of these kids will, uh, I mean, will never ever see live theater. They sometimes think they're going to a movie uh, and then they see it's live theater and they're completely into it and they're, to see their eyes is amazing. So.